Hello again. Today we're going to be um, boning out some chicken thighs. Uh, there seems to be a shift, I think, from using chicken breasts to using chicken thighs, with, with cooks and chefs saying there's a lot more taste in them. You can buy them already done, where they're already boned out, etc. But they are a hell of a lot dearer than just doing it yourself, and it is so simple to do. So we'll start, here we are with, with the pack basically, as simple as that. Jamie Oliver would say use free range chicken. We're using ones from Lidl's. There's one end of the bone, there's the other end of the bone, and it goes like that, probably about the size of my finger. Sharp knife, you can see the top and the bottom of, of, the, of the bone. So use the knife just to go in go in and round and it is basically just that simple and that's it it's out there is only one little bit is worth taking out so you just spread it out there there's there's another part there which sometimes it will be there and sometimes it won't it's like a little gristly bit there it's actually called the patella the kneecap and sometimes, like I said, it will be there and other times it may have been left on the drumstick. So that if you can just nick that out, you can feel it, it's, it's quite sort of bony. That's gone. The other one, and you'll have to have a look about for it, is the remains of the femoral artery that run through. You can just see it there, cameraman. And that, just to pick that out, like so. There's no real drama if it's left in, there's no problem with it, but as you can see it's, well, <laughs> quite sinewy. But it's not sinewy, it's an artery, the main artery that runs down. So that's the femur out, and the femoral artery out, and the patella. That's that, that's it done. Again, if you want to, um, you can leave the skin on, or that can be taken off. To take it off you just grab it with your fingers and pull the whole thing off. Personally I prefer to leave that in and on while it's cooking. That's one, I'll do one more very quickly. So here we are, chosen subject. Quickly through with a knife. Obviously watching your fingers. Can you see that cameraman? Okay. around and out. That's out. Then we look around for the patella which again is in there. Quickly nick that out. Then for the femoral you can see it there it looks like a little blood clot. Just follow it through with the knife. Quite bigger in this one actually. Pull it at its furthest end he said. And out it comes. Trim any residual fat off again if you want to, if you need to, uh, but it's completely up to you. But that's, that's that done. Now, another bit if you wanted to do it is put some stuffing in the middle, roll it over, tie it, and then that's like a little mini joint. But well, that's pretty much it. But um, anyway, thanks for watching.